And we're back, YouTube. Thank you for tuning in. As always, I appreciate that. And some four years ago, I did a video in which I compared the original Morrowind, The Elder Scrolls 3, with and without the Morrowind Overhaul mod. So the original graphics, I compared them to the graphics of the Morrowind Overhaul. Now, four years have passed, and I thought it was time to revisit Morrowind and see if we could do another one of those comparisons videos. So this this is how Morrowind starts. These are the original graphics. Looks dated, looks old. And we're just gonna follow the guard outside to the outside world. And that's basically how you start your adventure. So let's Head up. All right, so here we are. This is where they want you. Head down to the dock, and I'll show you through the sensor guard. All right, so take a look at the uh, surroundings here. Again, original graphics. I'm gonna skip the character creation, and we're going to pretty much the outdoors environment, as you can see. This, these are again the original graphics of Morrowind. Speak freely, friend. Still highly playable, by the way, but it just looks old, it looks dated, Anytime. not very detailed. Especially if you look at the signposts, there are no names on it, so you have to sort of put your cursor on it to see what it means. And let's go to the Silt Strider, the main way of transportation in Morrowind. Here we go. And I'm going to compare the original graphics with uh, the graphics of a heavily modded Morrowind. I'm using the Morrowind sounds and graphics overhaul or graphics and sounds overhaul. So let's do that. So these are the new graphics. Well, let's give myself a name. And again, the guard will come to fetch me and bring me on deck. So here he comes. As you can see, there's sort of a depth of view. If I focus on the faces of one of the characters, the other one is bl somewhat blurred, which is a nice effect. All right, dupe. See you around. I mean, look at the ship's interior. It even looks... it looks already detailed. Looks a lot better than the original. A lot more decorated as well. There are new sounds, new graphics. Get yourself up yeah, you'll be blown away if I go on deck, so let's do that. There's some more loading times, but you know, what can you do? You get to some really good graphics, so I'm okay with that. And take a look at that. This is where I mean, the character model looks very detailed. Look at the eyes. Look at this. Just look at this. Alright, so... Let's meet the guy here. Again, we're going to skip the character creation, and we'll be um, continuing from the point where you're released into the world. I mean, look at this. How colorful, how vivid, how sharp everything looks. It's fantastic, really. Really another testament of what modders can do in a modern age. It's... A lot more vegetation, a lot more sounds, and if you look at the uh, signposts, they actually have names on them now. And again, we're going to the uh, Silt Strider. A lot more lush, a lot more green. Look at the sun. So it's it just looks fantastic. 
it really takes Morrowind into uh, 2017. If you're gonna play Morrowind, make sure you install these mods. Also, Morrowind Rebirth I've installed, and a bunch of other mods, but I'll list them uh, below below the video. Oh, I mean, oh, vegetation is floating. Well, that's a bummer. Uh, but okay, I can deal with that. Let's take a look in the water. Ooh, very nice. Oh, man, just, just. I want to play Morrowind again. Alright, let's go up the hill. Seems to be kind of a watchtower there. I mean, you have to admit, it looks a lot better than the original. Alright, another signpost with actual names on it. Alright. Ooh, look at her face. Nice. Well, little hiccups here and there, but... Ooh, detailed road. Yeah, definitely gonna play more of Morrowind this year. 